So what we're looking at here is a bird's eye view of a couple of businesses on Main Street in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. Bringing your attention now to the black van, it's emerging from an Esso car wash. So the trail it leaves behind is only water and nothing to worry about. Keep an eye on it though. Thanks to the moisture from the car wash, we can easily follow it along to its next port of call. Now this is just sheer speculation, but I'm wondering if Esso has some kind of a promotion on where if you purchase a trip through the car wash, you get a coupon for a free ice cream or something at Dairy Queen. Because, spoiler alert, the black van is about to pull into the Dairy Queen drive through But wait, as we can now see from the air, there is no room for any more vehicles in the drive through Of course, this is the time of COVID-19, and so drive through services all over the country have thrived, while restaurant dining rooms themselves have closed down for fear of outbreaks. We need to keep this in mind as the probable cause of an excess of drive through traffic, and not just at Dairy Queen either. However, here at the Dairy Queen on Main, the drive through is not designed to host a very long vehicular lineup on the property. Now we can see here what happens when drive through traffic spills out onto the regular roadways. You can see how dangerous this is to have willy-nilly and frequent traffic jams on a thoroughfare like Main Street. Here, the traffic is known to be heavy, impatient, and quite often aggressive. You can see from the air a little bit of the conundrum from a traffic director's perspective. And unfortunately, it simply must be up to Dairy Queen, no fault of their own, to put a stop to this before somebody gets seriously hurt because of the cluster f that this truly is. Now this week in June of 2020, as the first wave of this horrible COVID-19 has begun to recede, restaurants are now permitted to reopen their doors if they have reasonable social distancing policies and infrastructure in place. It remains to be seen whether or not the drive through traffic of our city will peter out, or if it will continue to impede the regular flow of traffic. For safety's sake, I ask you, my good viewer, if on the way out for your next peanut buster parfait, if you do see that the lineup at the drive through bears no room for your vehicle, would you consider changing your plans, perhaps to return at a later date? It might just prevent an accident if you did. Thanks very much for watching the Automotive Daily Times. Your consideration is very much of value. See you next time. Until then, please drive safe. Oh, my God.